let's now cut across to Karnal with what has been a festering Kisan crisis in the city. The agitating farmers are completely unrelenting. They've continued to lay siege at the Karnal's mini secretariat as the Haryana government refused to take action against suspended SDM. They say he's transferred, there is an inquiry pending, and we'll see if we need to take action. The farmers and the union leaders, having none of it, they've squatted right in front of the mini secretariat, prompting us to ask will now the mini secretariat be the new single border? Because they don't want to move. They're saying no way till the time. The STM is suspended. The faces of a controversial agitation squatting outside the mini secretariat with thousands of protesters refusing to budge after talks with district administrations fail yet again. <laughs> The Kisan Kranti peaked in Karnal on 7 September as a sea of discontent flowed over barricades, water cannons and entered the mini secretariat, seeking revenge over the brutal Lati charge 10 days ago in Karnal. <laughs> Wanting the sacking of the STM who called for breaking their heads. <laughs> Demanding he be charged with murder of a farmer who died then in the protest and compensation for the dead and the injured. This mega siege is in protest against the August 28 police lati charge. The administration, other than transferring the Karnal SDM, did not pay any heed to the farmers' demands. The farm leader sat outside the secretariat on a dharna. The second round of talks with the administrations failed again on Wednesday. The Qatar government refusing to take any further action on the SDM. <laughs> The government has dubbed the protest purely political and farm leaders exploiting the naive farmers. Now, what do you think? 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 कुछ लोग अगर ये सोचते हैं कि वो किसानों की के जो है वो अकेले हितैषी हैं और किसानों के जो है वो सबसे बड़े नेता हैं तो वो उनकी गलत है However what might come as embarrassment to the government the Bharatiya Kisan Sangh the farmers organization affiliated to the Rashtriya Swayam Sevak Sangh the RSS has decided to hold demonstrations at district centers across the country terming the existing MSP, minimum support price regime, as a fraud. The Bharatiya Kisan Sangh released a statement on 7th September. The government should think more sympathetically about the ongoing farmers' protest. Whatever cost is incurred by farmers in growing crops should be insured to them. The government should either give a profitable price or explain to us why our demand is wrong. The current MSP is a fraud. There should be a law for MSPs. After months of festering, the farm agitation is gaining momentum again. The siege of Karnal, the Mahapanchayat in Muzaffarnagar. The call to draw political blood as revenge with the BJP. A protest and agitation with all its strengths and weaknesses is seeming to peak again in its ninth month. The gestation period is over. The proverbial child is born in midst of farmers now upping the stakes and the government still refusing to relent. With Maushmi Singh and Manjit Saigal in Karnal, Bureau Report, India Today. All right, viewers, let me just take you right now back to Karnal with what is happening. The farm leaders there, along with hundreds of supporters, farmers, have sat down refusing to move, which prompts us to ask the big questions tonight. Is Karnal mini-secretariat 
turning into the new single border because they say they are not going to budge till the time the demand is accepted, which is the suspension of the SDM. The Qatar government is having nothing to do with it. So is Karlal Mini Secretariat now turning into the new single border? The other question that we ask, has the breakhead comment touched a raw nerve with the Haryana farmers especially? Because clearly the farm leaders want to capitalize on that by now taking the agitation, the epicenter of it, to Karnal. The other question we asked, farm agitation peaking in the ninth month of protest, five months before elections, mind you. And the other one, we've seen a lot of echo in political parties, especially the Congress coming in favour of the farm protest, especially in Karnal. Is the farm protest now completely political? That is what the government is saying. And lastly, should the government not engage, re-engage with farmers and resume dialogue? Because how long? Will this festering feud continue? I want to cut across now, viewers, uh, to our guests this evening. Like I said, the latest situation coming in from the mini secretariat is that the farm leaders are not going anywhere. And they are actually saying that farmers from UP Haryana are now going to be called at the mini secretariat. It's the siege of Karnal. Like I said, is this now going to be the new single border? Let's ask our pa panelists this evening. Sanjeev Bunyal, advocate, political analyst, joins us. So does Tom Vadakan, Bharatiya Janata Party spokesperson. Shama Mohammed from the Congress, spokesperson. Savit Malik, President, Kisan Union, uh, is also with us. I want to cut across to Mr. Savit Malik. We also have Dharmendra Malik, media in charge, Bharatiya Kisan Union. Malik Sahab, I want to come to you first, Dharmendra Malik Ji. Yes. आपसे पूछना चाहूंगी कि आपके जो सहयोगी हैं टिकेट साहब हैं वहां पर बाकी सारे फार्म यूनियन लीडर्स हैं आपने तो वहां पे डेरा जमा लिया है और आप अभी कह रहे हैं कि यूपी के फार्मर हरियाणा के फार्मर बाकी सारे जो और किसान हैं वो उधर आ जाएं जो मिनी सेक्रेटेरिएट है क्या आप मिनी सेक्रेटेरिएट सिंगू बॉर्डर बनने जा रहा है नहीं देखिए एक 10 दिन का समय हो गया पूरे प्रकरण को और दो बार हमारे मोर्चे के जो लोग हैं संयुक्त किसान मोर्चा के जो दूसरे नेता हैं तीन बार उन्होंने प्रशासन को मिलकर बताया कि जो अधिकारी वहां ड्यूटी पे तैनात था उसने आचरण के विरुद्ध काम किया है और उसके जो लाठी चार्ज हुआ है उसमें किसान की मौत हुई है तो कानून देश में एक ही होता है एक चाहे वो अधिकारी हो चाहे वो जनता का आदमी हो अगर किसी की जैसे किसी की जान जाती है देखिये वो किसान ना तो कभी कहीं उस समय आंदोलन करने जा रहे थे उस उस समय तो बैठे हुए थे ना टोल पे और नौ महीने से बैठे हुए हैं और आप ये कहो कि सिर फोड़ दो कौन निकलना चाहिए और सिर लाल होने चाहिए और मैं सब देख लूंगा तो ये तो उसके ड्यूटी के विरुद्ध था उसको किसने ऑर्डर दिया था धर्मेंद्र जी चलिए ये बात बताइए क्या अब वहां से आप डटे रहेंगे जब तक आपकी मांग जो है इसको सस्पेंड किया जाए जो एस तब तक नहीं हलेंगे हिलेंगे देखिये छह सात मोर्चे हमारे चले हुए हैं एक मोर्चा और उबड़ गया वो आंदोलन तब तक जारी रहेगा जब तक वहां के किसानों को न्याय नहीं मिल जाता और टिकैत साहब और बाकी जो फार्म यूनियन लीडर्स हैं वहीं बैठे रहेंगे नहीं देखिए वहां प्रॉपर एक किसी की ड्यूटी लगेगी चाहे वो गुरनाम जी हो चाहे टिकैत साहब हो चाहे कोई भी हो क्योंकि हम आंदोलन का भटकाव नहीं होने देंगे हरियाणा सरकार चाहती है की हरियाणा में हिंसा कराओ और फिर वहाँ पे आंदोलन चले और बॉर्डर से आंदोलन भटक जाए हम इनकी चाल को समझ रहे हैं हमेशा the, the, you know, is, what we are creating is these mini, mini single borders all across because now these farm leaders they have a face you have a Rakesh ticket you have other farm leaders along with hundreds thousands of farmers who are going to be squatting in front of the mini secretariat pretty much holding the city of Karnal to ransom blocking roads there and this is going to continue till the they say till the government relents should the government re-engage now talk to them again pretty never was the uh, door shut they were always open the point is the subplots have been uh, been brought up essentially during the elections in bengal they plotted in bengal tried to this is a destabilization moment we are not dealing with a farmer agitation leader takai he is a dealer of vehicles, he's a petroleum dealer. You know him, it is doing all business other than farming. And this gentleman comes in the guise of a farmer, lost in elections, lost to the people, has come and taken up this leadership, thinking that he can overthrow a government. 
point is we have left the doors wide open. They can come and discuss. Now, what is this about a bureaucrat saying this? He will, the law will take its own course. There's an investigation in progress. He's been transferred. Now, their argument is about, uh, well, it's not the MSP that was announced today. That doesn't bother them. It's like a glass half full or half empty. The Mr. point Madhukar, here is, sir, what, can is I, the may agenda? I come in and... what is the agenda of Mr. Takai? Okay. What does he want? Who are his supporters? Abhi tak the, agenda the, farming, the farming sector okay. is giving okay. you a bumper agenda crop. Sir, they have given you a bumper crop. They have given you a bumper crop. The farmers are okay. working. Okay. And okay. where is this gentleman? Okay, Mr. Vadakar. Mr. Vadakar. Mr. Mr. Vadakar. I know, okay, sir, I'll urge you to just yeah. fall back a little so because I know you're getting, I know, I know, I know you're getting emotional, we can't see you very well. Sir, sir, inko bolne dijiye, sir, beech mein mat bolega, please, please, me, me darkhaast karoonge. Sir, sir, dealer bata sakte hai, aap sir, sir, me aapko darkhaast karoonge, beech mein na bolega. Par, Tom Badakhan ji, I'm going to ask you one quick question again before I go to our other panelists. You say that law is taking its course, the STM has been transferred, an inquiry has been ordered and it's due process. Now, most of these farmer, farm leaders and farmers are also saying what you've done in terms of transfer is given him a posting. It's not a punishment posting. It's a posting with a level up. He's additional secretary. Many people are viewing this as a promotion, not a transfer. Our friends, the farmers would expect him to send him to Andaman Nicobar. I mean, you, I mean, he's a bureaucrat. The inquiry is in progress. Unless proved otherwise, what is his intention? Was that uh, applicable? If, he, if it is true, then the government will act. Till the action is proved by a legal investigation that's going on. You okay. can't uh, transfer the man to Andamans just because no, a dealer no, but, wants but he's been transferred as he's been transferred as additional secretary. What should he be punished? Sent to jail directly? I mean, tell me. Sir, I mean, should, a, should he be jailed it's in... It's a promotion. Uh, for, it's for a kind of promotion duty? that is being viewed by them. That's what they're saying. Come again, I couldn't hear you. It's question. a promotion is what most people, especially the farmers, are saying. From an SDM, he's been promoted to an additional secretary. Handling. When you're moved from a job, you're handling okay. on a situation which warrants an investigation. And still, you call it a promotion. There's something uh, more than jaundice here. Okay. Savit Malik sahab, Tom Vadakanji sahab, you're saying that the transfer has been done. The inquiry 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 has प्रीति चौधरी जी इसमें एक मामला ये है कि किसान या आप या हम कोई मजदूर अगर कानून को तोड़ता है तो उतना महत्व नहीं है जो कानून को संभालने वाले हैं जिनको देश की पैसा लगाकर आईएएस की ट्रेनिंग कराई गई है वो आदमी अगर कानून तोड़ता है तो वो जांच को भी प्रभावित कर सकता है हमारी यही तो मांग है कि जब तक उसको निलंबित कराइए और जांच हो जाएगी तो अगर वो उसकी गलती है तो सजा मिलेगी नहीं तो बाहर आ जाएगा दूसरी बात ये जो अभी कह रहे थे डीलर बता रहे थे किसानों को अरे डीलर तो आप हो उद्योगपतियों के जिन्होंने किसानों को रात के अंदर चलिए 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 सावित मालिक जी मैं इसमें नहीं सावित मालिक जी जो बात है उसमें रहिएगा पैसे किलो गेहूं सावित मालिक जी ओके आई वांट टू गो टू शमा मोहम्मद आई वांट टू ब्रिंग इन शमा मोहम्मद बिकॉज़ दिस इज गोइंग टू बी अ स्लिंगिंग मैच शमा मोहम्मद आई वांट आई वांट ब्रिंग यू इन एंड आई वांट टू आस्क यू शमा मोहम्मद द फैक्ट इज टुडे the government has increased the msp it's happened in 10 years now in terms of you know the they are trying to appease the farmers just not rolling back the three farm laws is what the government is saying we've increased the msp we are open to dialogue we are right now anyway these laws are suspended all of this is politically motivated fueled by the congress okay priti can you just give me a few minutes uh, i mean uh, two minutes i just want to start off let's understand that this movement started last year from haryana going towards delhi and that's where these when the farmers were peacefully protesting there were lati charged water cannons beaten up now it's come full circle and let me tell you one thing this movement which mr modi thought would end is still strong after 9 months let me tell you very clearly this is the beginning of the end of the modi government in 2024 as well as in up these farmers are protesting because they really need the msp they want the msp in it now couple of things i want to come out clear here is then sdm who you know when a murder happens you don't have witnesses or if you catch a murderer on the spot you convict him put i mean you put him behind bars and the case goes on a thief you catch him you take him take him to the police station here you have video evidence of of the sdm telling 
telling the police that, you know, the uh, farmers are protesting peacefully, you go and break their heads. It is there. The evidence is out there. Now, why is Mr. Manohar Lal Qatar not taking action? I'm going to call him a gunda CM. You know why? Because he instructed this SDM to do that. That is the reason he's not even, forget being dismissed. He's, he should be arrested. He should not just be dismissed. He should be arrested because he asked them to break their heads. Another thing you've asked about the MSP. It is the worst increase in a decade, one. And let's remember when the Congress party was in power, the price of diesel was around 55 rupees. What is the price of diesel now? Around 100. Okay. So what do they get out of it? Nothing. And one one last point. Mr. Um, the um, uh, Mr. Wadakan was telling a very important point. He said that this man is somebody disguised as whatever, whatever. I want to ask him, what was Anna Hazare? An RSS okay. man disguised as an activist. And also, he was again pointing fingers saying there is conspiracy. Then why is the Bharat Kisan Sangh a part of the RSS? They are, they are Kisan Union okay. saying that we want the MSP. He has to answer to that right now. Yeah, we were, we were, I was, it's a part of our story. It is a part of our story. But I'm going to ask you one question, Shama. Do you think the Congress has done the biggest disfavor to the farmers' movement, what you're talking about, by hitching your wagon to what many would assume the Congress looks at the farmer gravy train? and slowed it down because now the, op the government looks at this movement as political. Of course. What, what do you mean? If there is an issue like this and if we are not involved, you people point fingers and say, you know what the Congress party is not doing. It is our job as a political party to speak when somebody's rights are taken away. There was a farm bill which was passed in parliament without any discussion with the opposition, without any discussion okay. with the alliance partners, without any discussion with any of the unions or anything. Because the RTI reply clearly says that. Whereas they go to the Supreme Court and say we discussed it with everybody. So this is how they lie. Okay. Of course All we right. stand with the farmers. Sanjeev I no want to bring you in. Madam, I need to go to our next guest. Sanjeev Unyar. Okay, Sanjeev Unyar, I want to bring you in. You know, usually in politics they say a campaign, a movement, a political party in an election needs to peak at the right time. Do you think that the farm agitation in its ninth month has peaked at the right time, peaked not too late, not too early right now because you're five months before elections that they could actually draw political blood or it's just an agitation which could peter away? Priti, it could be uh, dissectionally dissected first of all. What is going on, your question, that epicenter of this particular debate was whether this Karnal site is going to turn into the Shingu water type of thing. Yes, I suppose, I presume you are absolutely right. It's a dangerous step. People are coming in thousands, then in lakhs, and they are growing, they are doing, they, they are doing all mischiefs. If somebody, administration, takes some stricter action against them, then they are surprised. Then they take that SDM is to be transferred, SDM is to be suspended, and where posting, which posting he has to be given. So farmers are, instead of doing anything, Regarding the farming, they are doing administration part, they are doing the police part, they are doing the cop part, they are doing all the political parties, leaders part, except doing but farming. Mr. Unyal, this is a vulnerable situation. But Mr. Unyal, so the Bharatiya Kisan Sangh, but Mr. Unyal, sir, sir, I want to ask you a question months. as well. The Bharatiya Kisan Sangh, which is an RSS affiliated Kisan outfit, are saying exactly that, no? They have protested in multiple sites across the country today. Are they wrong? Not exactly what uh, this BKU and these other parties, Tikayat and other... Sir, I'm talking about BKS. Forget about BKU. They are, about BKU. They, they are touching some very important... Sir, forget about BKU. Forget yeah, about BKU. Tell me yeah, about BKS. BKS. I am saying I am touching the same. Are you listening to me, Malik Sir? Just listen to the work. 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 No, no. One second. Mr. Unyal. Mr. Unyal. Let's not get into... Just see. What is the work? Sir, I'm going to ask you, okay, I'm going to take this question because I clearly don't want to answer it. I'm going to take this question to Tom Vadakan. Tom Vadakan, the BKS, forget about BKU, forget about TKS. I'm giving you the answer. I'm giving the exact answer to you. Give it, sir, quickly. Yeah, I want to tell you that could be, I'm going towards a solution. Could be, BKS, the Bharti Kisan Sangh, what you are saying is a part and parcel of RSS. Yes, it's an independent body, but could be some part of that three laws 
they are touching in certain points that should be reformed. Sir, they have said very amended. clearly that yeah, they have said that MSP should become law. Going on continuously with the Tomar also. Beca beca so, but they are they're saying, not saying what is okay. exactly BK is saying. Okay. They are saying MSP should be law. They don't want all laws repeat. But I'll go to Tom Vadakan there, which a question that Shama also raised. Yeah, As we speak today, Mr. Okay, sir, 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 I'm going to that Mr. Vadakan, please. That is their submission. Okay, Mr. Vadakan, I want you to come in on this yes, because yes. it's not about BKU, it's not about Mr. Tiket. Let's talk about the BKS, which is the Bharatiya Kisan Sam. They are a part of protest today. They protested in multiple sites. They've given out a statement saying that MSP should become law. We are not against the farmers protesting. Okay. We are not against demands that are being made by farmers. We are we are against the politicization please. of farmers. Yes, and if the, if the okay. BKS has acted the way it has, it is acting on the genuine purpose of a dialogue okay. between the government. And if that is desirable, so there's good we have farmer, there's bad farmer. Open, okay. And we are welcome I need to, to it. I need to, you know, we're getting in breaking news and uh, hopefully very good news in terms of the team there. I, I, I'm going to bail out of this debate a little early. Appreciate all of you for joining us. I'm sorry if somebody wanted to come in, but we have to dip into news break.